Hello everybody, my name is Ethan from Ethan Store Lab here, and today I'll be comparing two Albus Dumbledore Lego minifigures. One that is from the Great Hall that are that you are seeing right here. He is a very cool one, and this one is based off of the Sorcerer's Stone, and I will be comparing him to the Albus Dumbledore from the Collectible Minifig series. This one is a lot different in my opinion. This one's based off of the Goblet of Fire. This one also is a very cool minifigure, but today I'll be comparing them to you, showing the differences and similarities, and we're starting right now. So first off for the similarities, they obviously both have the same wand. It is the same wand because all the molds are exactly the same and it is in the exact same color. This was kind of an obvious note, but that is one of their similarities. One other notable difference is that the one in the collectible minifig series has one of the new 2018 dress pieces, or at least I think they're 2018, and the one from the Hogwarts Great Hall uses regular minifig legs. And then the next very obvious difference is the beards. They are two completely different beard pieces. The one on the left from the CMF series has more of a tie-up beard and the one on the right is more of just your average beard, I guess you could say. So there is one of their other very notable differences. And then a very similar difference. They're almost completely similar, but the CMF version has a hair and hat combo with a little golden thingy on the side, I don't really know what to call it, and then the one from the Hogwarts Great Hall is almost like the one from the um, Collectible Minifig series, but except it has a hat, and I think that the um, Goblet of Fire, um, the Collectible Minifig hair piece, is just slightly, just slightly, a little bit darker than the one from the Hogwarts Great Hall, but other than that, almost the same hair piece, but with a hair and hat combo instead. I know I know Dumbledore looks weird without his beard piece, but I wanna say that the two facial expressions are very similar, except they're just different prints. Um, the Goblet of Fire version is just a little bit darker. He doesn't have any dual face expression, but the, um, the Great Hall one does, and he's got one with glasses and then one without glasses. Here's a look at the tourist shows, both very detailed, but both like polar opposite, two completely different colors, but the details are amazing. And then here's a look at the back. The one in the CMF line does not have any back torso printing, but the Hogwarts Great Hall minifig does have some continuing on the back. Alrighty guys, that is it for this video. Please tell me if you like this concept or not, and if I should do more of it. Do you like this video? Consider checking out some of my other videos, or consider subscribing and hitting that bell notification so you don't miss any other fun LEGO videos. I'll see you guys later. Bye.